Why is Alzheimer's called type 3 diabetes? Type 3 diabetes is a term that was proposed by a team of scientists from Brown University in 2005 to describe the association between diabetes and Alzheimer's disease. This term has been used to look at potential triggers of Alzheimer's disease in people with diabetes or insulin resistance. We have a large body of evidence, including an analysis that we published in 2018, that people with insulin resistance have poor cognitive state and they're at an increased risk of developing Alzheimer's. Insulin resistance is a reversible condition where the body and the brain cannot efficiently use glucose as a source of energy, and it's usually related to poor diet and lifestyle. Type 3 diabetes is not considered a medical diagnosis, and labeling Alzheimer's disease as type 3 diabetes is generally controversial. Prolonged and uncontrolled abnormality in glucose metabolism is just one of the many mechanisms that can lead to Alzheimer's. The other mechanisms that contribute to increased Alzheimer's disease are prolonged history of inflammation, oxidation, lipid or fat dysregulation, alcohol abuse, or certain toxins. The good news is that if identified early enough and treated, the risk is reduced significantly.